So if you ever wonder what an overworld battle would look like in RPG Maker MV, you don't need to worry about that anymore. I'm gonna show you. Um, so I spent, I don't remember how much time working on this, probably way too much. I don't know if it's been done before. I don't know if it'll be done since. Probably it'll be done again, cause I don't know, I'm pretty cool. People might wanna copy me. But I essentially made it so you can have a straight up battle in the overworld. Uh, it's still pretty rough, very clunky, um, but it works and that's what counts, right? That's what counts in my brain. Uh, so we're gonna go through this little intro and then I did make the enemy sprite myself and as the battle goes on you'll see it helps uh, like demonstrate demonstrate the amount of damage that the enemy's taken. And so, a uh, pretty simple uh, menu. You can move around. Uh, it's mainly all based on variables. So every step you take changes the amount of variables that you have left. So it changes the amount of steps you have. And then once you're out of movement, you can't really move anymore. You can't turn or anything. I can add a, another menu option that'll allow you to turn. Probably once you've ran out of uh, movement spaces, I could probably edit that really easily. And then you have uh, skills. I haven't been able to make it so skills are like specific towards a direction or really uh, much. <laughs> I kind of just have it so they're set at an effect. Um, but uh, the effect can be probably just like battle specific and so as you see as I'm dealing more damage it's losing its wings which is a good indicator for uh, it dying and I'm just showing off all the skills I have uh, and then essentially once you reach a certain variable threshold each time you deal damage it adds one and then once it hits a certain variable the battle's over the enemy's dead and you can see it's corpse here, and I can gloat over it. Um, uh, if you're interested in how I did it, you can always feel free to ask. <laughs> but yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. I'm way too proud of how clunky it is.